I'm Eric Singer, Gazette.com. Our Friday military salute starts with a mom in medical trouble and ends with her six-year-old daughter helping to save the day. One, two, three, four, five, six. Inside this home on Peterson Air Force Base, it's game time for the Boyd family. On May 14th, it was go time for six-year-old Sunila. Well, I got home from school and I was upstairs and I heard a noise. I came downstairs and my mom was on the floor. And then I quit calling 911 for my mom. They told me to open the door, so I did. I was dizzy. I've been dizzy for the past couple of weeks, but um, this time it wasn't going away. And I was going up the stairs or down the stairs, and then I just woke up and the paramedics was there. Do you think your daughter's a hero? Yeah. I do, for her to do what she did, how she did it, what she said. She's definitely my hero. Something that Sanila believes comes from her dad, Fort Carson soldier, Sergeant Michael Boyd. I'm going to be a doctor and um, my dad, he um, saves the country, so I wanted to save someone too. Written on her medal that she received at a recent ceremony, courage, bravery, hero, and honor, faith in family, and 911. It's important because if anything was to happen and the child was there alone with one parent, the child needs somebody to come and help them because there's not a lot that they can do. Um, Nyla said the people on the phone told her to turn me over, but she couldn't. So. She needed help, and 911 definitely came to help. Sanila is the first recipient of the 911 Award for Heroism given out at Peterson Air Force Base. With your Friday military salute, Eric Singer, Gazette.com.